Welcome back to Ground Zero. Hey D, what's the longest time you've spent queuing? Um, two hours in the very hot sun. That was for a bag sale. <laughs> was it worth it? Uh, not really. All the bags were gone after that. <laughs> no. Well, even though it was a bit of a waste of your time, would you have taken your frustration out on the people in front of you? Like in this story, impatient girls couldn't stop whining at the ATM queue and even pass rude remarks. A stomper said that these two girls kept whining and whining when they had to wait their turn at this DBS ATM at Parkway Parade. They even passed rude remarks to the people in front of them in the queue. And that's really rude. Yeah. That's what stomper usjag underscore 18 said. I admit I also whine, but when there's a long queue, just make a choice. Queue up or just don't withdraw money. Don't complain in front of others. That's so rude and distracting. And then another stomper felt that the whining was justified. Mm -hmm. Isabel said, Seriously, can you tahan people hogging onto the ATM machine for so long? Oh, Not one person, no, but a few people taking their own sweet time. And the queue is so long. And is it wrong to whine in public? It's just like you're happy with something and you complain to a friend. Who doesn't complain? Yeah, that's true. I see that point, you know. What happened to the face? Grin and bear with it, you know. I think maybe Singaporeans just like to complain about everything. <laughs> But having said that, even though I'm normally quite chill, I get really pissed off waiting in line at the post office. What's the longest you've ever waited? I think about 45 minutes. I don't mind that there are other people in front of me in the queue because there always will be other people. I just get really upset when I see that there's only one or two staff serving customers and there's a huge queue forming or when one of the staff decides to staple papers instead of serving customers. I mean, what kind of customer service is that? Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, like in this next story, queue at post office didn't move even after 35 minutes. Stomper KH Tan was queuing up at the post office with her maid to send remittance back and was disappointed by the long wait of 35 minutes and the lack of staff to help make things more efficient. Okay, let's see what Stompers had to say. I love Stomp, 9 said on 1st February, very fast already, try one hour and the queue never moves. Well, this stomper actually has a good suggestion. Soul Girl said on 30th January that, you know, 2010, go online or ATM machine nowadays, have all the jobs done with it. Why queue up? Yeah, I have an even better idea. What? I just give my mother a do. 